Welcome back everyone to the HWBot World Tour 2016 and this is the award ceremony for the HWBot World Series 2016 North America. We are here at the LAN ETS in Canada and we will be tuning in into our uh, into the award ceremony. This was the Wow, the, the strongest and the fastest um, um, final we had to uh, to deal with here at the Edge of World Series. And as you can see, the judge, Mr. Christian Ney, is uh, ready to uh, start the award ceremony. I will be doing the commentary for you guys live. So first of all, we had the, uh, the amateur. First of all, we had the amateur to um, to uh, to start uh, the award ceremony. Third amateur to be co to come here, Bergelicious. Bergelicious winning a G skill DDR4 two times four gigabyte memory kit. That's ex the same kit they were using during the competition for both the amateur and the extreme competition. Number two, after defending his. Uh, his pride in a very tight battle is Olivier Apex and he would be going back home with a nice set of hour composed of a PSU, a motherboard Z Maximus 8 Hero from Asus and a prototype, one of the six prototypes of the Open Benchable project. Olivia Apex that scored 2878 total points against Match Eye, but Match Eye had it all with 90, 90, 2910 points. Champion of the Edge Rebot World Series for Amateur, Match Eye. He was defending his, his, his title uh, after the uh, qualification. He won first against Rudolf and then he won against Oliver Apex. Congratulations Machai. You are going back home with a, one of the few prototypes here in North America of the Open Bench Table Project, a G-Skill Memory Kit, an Asus Maximus 8 Hero uh, motherboard and a Seasonic P760 Watt Platinum Power Supply. On to the Edge of Blood World Series 4 Extreme, third place, Mr. Breeze, winning a G-Skill DDR4 memory, memory kit. Mr. Breeze is actually not in the elite league, the highest league you can play in Edge of Blood is in the uh, Apprentice League and this was his second time of the Edge of Blood World Tour, he was here last year as well. Second person in the ranking is currently number two in Canada, Raspardi, Tony by his name. Defend his title very well. He's going back home with a bench table, a Maximus 8 Hero, and a PSU power supply from Seasonic, the P760 Watt. And the winner of this HWBot World Series 2016 here in North America at the LAN ETS in Montreal is Mark0053. And Mark is the current number one of Canada, is the current number one of the country. Is going back home with the memory kit, uh, 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 prototype of the open bench table. Uh, by Stricom, CTV and HW, but a Seasonic power supply P760 watt and an Asus Maximus 8 Hero motherboard. Congratulations to him, that was a tight battle for sure. And these guys, Mark is actually winning, the most important thing is Mark is winning a ticket for the HWBot World Championship to happen in Germany by the end of the year. And it will be flown to Germany, Berlin, to defend his title of champion of North America, can he become the champion of the world? Not sure, but we will see in December. 
Thank you guys for tuning in this live show all weekend long on Overclocking TV. Uh, we are very pleased to be part of this adventure. We would like to thank the partner of this event, Asus, Seasonic, and Praxer. I would like to thank our uh, support partner as well, uh, Tetra for the Computex uh, Overclock.net community. You guys have been awesome on the live chat. We always like to have you around here. If you, I will maybe go see you guys in the few weeks in Toronto because you guys are having an event right there. Uh, thank you, Techmundo. Uh, the biggest IT portal in uh, Brazil, uh, OCTV here as well, uh, Streetcom and Microbytes for uh, the bench table and some of the hardware for the workshop, uh, OCESports.io and HWBotX. These have been an awesome and great event. Um, we can't wait to be to the next one and the next HWBot World Tour will be during Computex at the end of May, so the May 31st until June 4th and this will be on the show floor at Computex in Taipei, Taiwan. So this one will be even bigger than anything we ever done before. We can't wait to announce to you to all the details and I can't wait to be back there in Taiwan to present to you the HWBot World Tour 2016 for the fifth top this year. Thank you very much for watching this live stream. If you want to find us, you can find all the replay on our YouTube channel, youtube.com forward slash overclocking TV. You can find uh, all the information on our Twitch channel as well, twitch.tv forward slash overclocking TV. You can find us on Facebook, YouTube, and uh, Twitter and Instagram as well. You can go on, uh, you can find HWBot as well in there. But until next time, keep pushing it.